Listed as a historic monument and as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, the St. Hilaire Roman Church in Mel counts several depictions of people among its sculptured decorations. Compared to sculptures in other Romanesque churches in the Melois area, they give us an insight into the daily life and entertainment in the Middle Ages. This capital illustrates big game hunting, which was reserved for lords. A richly dressed man kills a wild boar with his hunting spear, assisted by hounds. Noble women were able to take part in hunting on horseback with falcons, like men. The birds killed and brought back small game themselves, as we can see in this bas-relief that comes from the Javersey Church. Exotic animals such as lions may have been exhibited for the entertainment of the people and the nobility. As in the church in villiers sur chise those exhibiting the animals and the tamers seem to impress their audience by measuring up to the wild creatures. Representations of humans fighting animals often symbolize the battle of good versus evil, the Christians versus the sins that would consume them. Following this theme, a man removes the thorn of evil that was inside him in the St. Pierre Church in Mel. Coming back to the world of entertainment, wrestling matches were put on in public by professionals. They sometimes used accessories in contests of strength, like in this example from Verine Soussel. Music played an important role in livening up the festivities and accompanied the first courtly love stories. Here, two musicians play a psaltery harp, while the two viol players accompany an acrobat dancing on its head, in a scene identical to this capital in the villiers sur chise church. Acrobats, musicians, wrestlers, and animal tamers were all included in entertainment under the title of minstrels.